Hello, my name is Julia and today we will report a cacti and it's this one. This is Mammillaria vetula, subspecies Gracilis. I will put this in a corner because I'm not pronouncing that right, I bet. And as you may see, I had to tie this cacti with a rope because he was going all over the place and when he goes too far from the pot, these little parts break off and yeah, I usually just put them back to the pot and they give me roots and that way I got this huge beautiful full pot of cacti and I'm over that now because I don't have space anymore in this pot so I decided to report him and as you may see he's blooming for some time now I posted this one on Instagram and he has this beautiful tiny yellowish yellow white flowers and I'm so excited about this it's really easy to easy to grow cacti and it's really not easy to report cacti because it's so fragile if you just touch him in a wrong way he will break off so I have no idea what will happen today how much of these will be actually on this after reporting how much of these small little parts will stay on the basic mother plant so we will see and by now he was in this plastic nursery pot and now I want to plant him in this terracotta pot it's just a basic terracotta pot and I think he will love that just because he is breaking off all the time and this way I will have all this space around him for that when he break off he will just shoot some roots and it's done I don't have to mess with him and I will plant him in just basic potting mix mixed with perlite and a little bit of river sand so let's do that I really like cacti I have I think over 20 varieties and I really enjoy those kind of plants but it's hard to have them here where I live because we have harsh winters and I have to keep them indoors for overwintering and that it's not su such a great thing because they elongate and they don't look that great when you do that so yeah but I don't have choice and I don't have grow lights so over the winter from October to May almost they just barely survive so yeah it's not that great but I won't give up from them because I really like cacti's and some of varieties are pretty good in handling all that so yeah I'm keeping those that can survive that harsh treatment so I'm doing that with this one too and this one is doing especially great so I'm really happy about this one and I was just eyeballing this mix as you may see there are plenty of perlite and plenty of sand so now let's see how this will go I really don't want to damage any of these new shoots oh 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 whoa I'm really happy how this ended up well, I will just be gentle. As you may see, he holds all of this soil because the roots are really, really fine, but there are a bunch of them. I need to 
move some of this soil and I won't mess with the roots too much. I will just wiggle a little bit of this and that's it. I won't damage them because I don't want to. <laughs> I really want to be gentle with this one. He's doing so great and it's blooming so I don't want to mess with him. And let's see if this will be good idea because this pot is not that deep but cacti is usually like that so we will see I think this is how I want to put him here yeah it will be great and now I will just add this mix all around and I'm sorry for the noise that you hear in the background it's a vacuum cleaner <laughs> from a lower floor so sorry I didn't know that this will happen <laughs> but what can we do I will just rush it up that he will bloom after this also that I didn't somehow mess with that so we will see a little bit more of the sand all cacti like to be in well drained soil so yeah let's take care of that gorgeous I really like this pot I got this one from my sister-in-law so yeah I'm really happy about this these are usually expensive here where I live so I never buy them uh, every one of them that I have I got as a gift so yeah and here it is I think this will be great oh one of them just fall off as I said that usually happens with this one so I will just put him back here in a pot and he will grow that always happens and I will actually leave this this tie that I on him because he will just go like so and I don't want him to do that I, I'm scared that he will break off so as you may see he's all wobbly and yeah I will leave this guy and I think it's cute it, look, it looks great for me so he's going back on my west facing window and we will see how this will go now I will water him and yeah, that's it. Thank you so much for being here with me. I hope you enjoyed this small cute cacti and see you next time. Goodbye.